Chow, Chin Chow's Juice Beats Games here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Zeta Randomized Bravery Run Challenge. In the last episode, we made it right here to Groovy Town. And in today's episode, we're going to go around this place and possibly even challenge that gym. I owe my life to the Rangers Club. At first, I was a no good vigorant who roamed the streets looking for. Uh, Stealing from light, uh, stealing for living. Until, until all that changed. They gave me a bed to sleep, warm food, and a loving family. Would you like to? You can join this uh, on the southern, southern side of Kirby Town. Okay, we'd love to have you. Oh, I want to be a Pokemon Ranger. That's one of the. That's one of my favorite gym class uh, trainer classes. I love Pokemon Ranger. Being a Pokemon Ranger. Graham, the gym leader of this city, is quite a fierce trainer. There's a police car going by. It's annoying me. It's very, very annoying. Please stop going by my house. Anyway, I heard the Elite Four even... That, I heard that the Elite Four are even stronger than Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll see about this Elite Four eventually. I don't need a repel. I'm in town now. I'm not coming... I'm not going back out into that field again. Hello. The east coast of here is uh, Laguna Town. I heard Team Asgard is doing something over there. You should go and check it out. I would if I had surf. Because that looks like a river there. Oh great, Olga. Uh, altar of uh, passive entertainment. Bestow me with a discount imaginations at such speed. To make my linear force impossible. Yeah, that's a great way to explain what a TV is. <laughs> Have you challenged the gym yet? Graham is really a really young trainer, but damn, he's tough. Have you challenged the gym yet? Graham is a really strong trainer, but damn, he's tough. Okay, you two said the exact same thing. I wonder if when I challenge the gym and I come back here, that you all say different things. Hello. Have you seen Graham yet? Um, I know he's only 11, but he's pretty cute. Tee He's 11. You leave him alone. Also, you move out the way now so I can get past. You leave him alone. He's 11. He does not want know what he's doing. My daddy has an absol he's willing to give away. Do you want it, perchance? I might, depending on what he's willing to give me for it. Hello, young trainer. Have you challenged our local gym yet? I have not. Hello. Graham is, a uh, Graham is the gym leader of this town. He's a tough ghost type trainer. Are you planning on challenging him? Good. Well, you'll need a good dark or ghost type to take him down. Do you have one? Um, I have RTK. Ah, never mind then. What if I say no? Do you like to trade for an Absol? Any Pokemon will do. You know, I wouldn't mind taking you my Abs. I would not mind uh, taking your Absol away if you want any Pokemon for it. Hello, Ranger House. Okay, there's a lot of Pokemon here. I'm worried that Team Asgard's going has some disturbing side plans for the Poke Pokemon. Well, the Rangers just have to stop them. Hey, are you a Pokemon Ranger? Uh, yes. Oh, wow, that's great. Here. <laughs> I'm not a Pokemon Ranger. <laughs> Fooled you. I'm not a Pokemon Ranger. Not yet, anyway. But at least you gave me Fly. That's awesome. Being a, uh, being a Ranger can be a dirty job, but it's really, really fun. I really like being a ranger. I get to explore cool places and meet new people and become friends with rare Pokemon. I'm the best ranger around. I've saved over a hundred Pokemon from the unlawful immortal immoral owners. Hey, hello. You look like quite a tough tra quite a trainer. You should check out the Ranger program. Join it you could join us. I might. These Pokemon that are sheltering are rescued 
from some strange hypnotic device. I really hope they'll be okay. Hello. I'm the Ranger Clubmaster. If you believe in freedom from Pokemon exploration, you should join us. What do you say? Uh, sure. Okay, come see me when uh, uh, to do a mission whenever you're ready. I will definitely do that. You know what? I think I might do that soon. I want to get my gym badge first because I want to be able to use fly outside of battle. But uh, I definitely would think about coming back here and doing some ranger missions and also doing the uh, police club missions as well. I might actually take a few boat. We might do do those like side episodes for the series. I really want to join the rangers, but they don't want me. They said my Pokemon wasn't strong enough. But my weed, my weed will show them. Yes, it will, mate. You believe that. You believe in your Weedle and it will show you no mercy. It will show them no mercy. They will rue the day they don't let you into the Pokemon Ranger Club because you have a Weedle. Ah, oh, so that's the entrance for the, uh... That's the entrance for the secret base. Okay. And here's the gym. Can we go in? Hi, champ in the making. This is Graham's gym. He may be 11, but he sure is tough. He uses ghost type Pokemon, a type that's immune to normal, uh, it's both normal and fighting types. Be sure not to use psychic types, but dark types and other ghost types might just help you out. I'm saying this because the fact I'm saying it so quietly because the lights are off in here and uh, this guy's invisible. This guy's invisible. I'm not sure. Like a couple when we challenged the first gym, we were the invisible ones, but now they're the invisible ones. And that's a Tyrantrum. That's kind of scary. I learned C bomb off screen whilst grinding uh, whilst grinding up facing the trainers. I did not face in the last episode. I learned Seed Bomb and I love it. Zenny's been so ultra powerful, and it's just amazing how work how much work Zenny's been putting in. Zenny, bite. Tarantrum down. Level 36 for Zenny. Zenny's trying to learn spiky. Oh, spiky shield is your move. Spiky shield is the move you learn. Bite. Get rid of bite. I want spiky shield. Spiky shield is your is your signature move. I don't even know what's coming in. I don't know what's coming in. Taylo. Uh, rock slide. We ain't get to... Ow, ow, are we, ow, we, ow. Throw rocks at this head. There we go. Nice work, Zenny. And a Malamar. Uh... Oh, who can fight a Malamar? Make him fight a Malamar. Make him fight a Malamar. I'm hurt by the stealth rocks, but I make him fight a Malamar. Shop kick. Oh, that does nothing. Uh, frustration. That does slightly more, but it doesn't really work anymore. I really need to teach. No, you know, no. This Malamar is going to kill me, and I don't like that. I need to find it. I need to switch out. Meg, you need to be safe. I need to save you so you can end up evolving someday. You need to become an ultra amazing Lapunny. You are not a Lapunny yet. Oh my god, this Malamar is going to kill me. This Malamar is going to kill me. This, there's literally nothing I can do. This Malamar is going to destroy me. Beacon, Thunder Punch. Wow. This Malamar. This Malamar is going to destroy me. There goes Beacon. At least I got the static off. At least that's something. RTK coming in here. Bubble Beam this thing. Or strength. There we go. Oh. Trainer Doom. Cool Trainer Doom. To hell with you, Doom. To hell with Cool Trainer Doom. I did not like that one bit. 
He put up the fight. That Malamar. That Malamar. I do not have things to do with Malamar. I don't have Bug. Like, Bug would be an amazing thing to do with Malamar. I don't have Bug, though. Um. Right. What can I do with TMs? I know you can... You know what? I want to teach Meg Return. I've been thinking about this for a while now. Meg should be... A Meg should learn Return. Meg should learn Return over Frustration because Frustration is not helping her anymore because she's now happy... She's getting happier with us. So she should be okay with that. Uh, can anyone else learn anything else that is important right now? I guess I could teach, like... I want to teach Beacon Return, too. Because Beacon needs a fourth move, and he's my starter. He's going to be really happy with me. It's just a matter of fact. It's going... To, he's going to be happy with me. So, Return is a good move to get Beacon, because Beacon will be happy with me. He's my starter. Of course he's happy with me. Why would he not be happy with me? I'm a good trainer. Uh, what's this way? There's another one of these invisible trainers. I'm no match for your Pokemon. We'll see about this. We'll see if I am no match for your Pokemon. You start with an Azoral. I think I am plenty of a match for an Azoral. Seed Bomb. Helping hand? You're, you're, you're one Pokemon. You can't helping hand anything. Yeah, I'm a match for a... S oh, and you have a Slowpoke as well. I'm a match for that too. I am a match for your Pokemon. Bye bye. I am a match for your Pokemon. Uh, is there anything else here? Nope. Hello. It's really hard to see the trainers in this gym since they're invisible. Which is which is sort of implied, really, but... It's sort of hard to figure out where they're going to be because of that one reason. You can't use Magical Leaf on me. It does nothing. Rock Slide. Die. Nice work, Zenny. I probably... You know what, Zenny? You are too high leveled for me to keep you out at this moment in time. I want to switch hands to somebody else. I'm going to put Meg at the front of the party. And not no. I'm going to put I'm going to put Bitey at the front of the party for a moment in time. I might put Meg at the front of the party eventually. I need to give him. I need a soothe bell or something like that for Meg. Hiri armor. Ooh, that's a scary Pokemon to be dealing with. Venno Shark. Belly drum. Oh, it's okay. I'm faster. I'm faster than you. Belly drum is an ultra scary move, but then I remember I'm faster than you, so it doesn't really help you in any way, shape, or form. Go for reader. You know what? I can stay in on that. I can stay in on your go for reader. I can bite this thing. Oh, that's did nice damage. And you flinched. Die. Yep, die. And a final Pokemon of a Magnezone. That is not your job to deal with. That is Kickstarts. Right, Kickstart. You're about to evolve into a Blaziken. I wanted to leave this for an on-screen. I would have probably pressed the B button if this happened off-screen. But that's a crit rage mode. Thank you. Evolve into the Blaziken. What? Kickstart is evolving! Yay! Kickstart! You can become awesome now. This is awesome. We have Blaziken! I'm so happy with a Blaziken. Blaziken, Strangle, and Blaze Kick! Yes! Um. You don't need Peck anymore. Yes, we have Blaze Kick now. We have a Blazer Kern, and it's amazing. 
Uh, is there anything down here? This is supposed to be the way to go through this gym. No, that's a dead end. Well, where the hell do I go? Where the hell do I go? Seriously, like, I don't know where I'm going here. Do I go the way that the other trainer was? I go this side of Clyde? I must go this side of Clyde. Okay. Let's see what this girl has. Because I want to challenge this gym today. You start off with a Grimer. Bitey go. Uh, bitey bite it. Mud bomb. Okay, you missed. Cool. Nice work. Fling. But it failed because you're not holding an item. Let me guess. Level 31. You're trying to learn Night Slash. Yes. You are trying to learn Night Slash. And yes, I want that over Bite. Because Night Slash is amazing. Bite is okay. But Night Slash is amazing. And look what just learned Night Slash. There's a Dust Skull coming in. And we just learned Night Slash. Damn, stab would have killed. If it was stab, it would have killed. If this was a dark po- If Bidey was a dark poison type, he would have killed. <laughs> he would have just one shot that Dust Skull. If he was a dark poison type, but no. That's fine too, though. What's up here? Uh, is there anything up here? Hang on, I'm gonna find my way through this gym. Gonna find my way through this gym. Despite the fact that all the lights are turned off, I'm going to find my way through. Gastrodon. Um, I want to poison find this. Oh, that does nothing. But I am... You are badly poisoned now. Ow. Okay. Alright. I know what to do. His name is Senny. His name is Senny. By the you survive, which is good. Hidden power. Okay, it's not a hidden power I need to worry about. Seat bomb. Gastrodon down. Nice. It's always that Gastrodon you see. You never see the blue one. I don't know what that is. Semi Sage. Look who has a Blaziken now. That's right, me. I have a Blaziken now. This semi sage is just gonna get destroyed. Blaze kick. Oh my god, this blaze looking just is amazing. Oh yeah. I like that. Um Items. Super potion. There we go. I have type of potions too. Oh, I must I'll use the super potions first though. I'll use my super potions first. I don't exactly know where where I'm going here. Mushana! Ooh, nice. Uh, Bidey, can you Night Slash this? Ooh, Night Slash does quite a bit of damage to Bidey. Oh. So much for Bidey doing damage. RTK, can you come out here and do some damage? Knock off. One more knockoff should kill. Lucky Chant, you can't. Uh, so I can't crit you anymore, but that's fine. I wasn't plat. Uh, that's totally fine. Really? You live with. I don't even know how much HP is there, but literally, it's like literally nothing. How do you live? Mishana's bulky. That's probably why you live. Right, you're ghost and ground type. I have things to deal with you now. Back in the days of episode 3 of this challenge, I didn't have things to deal with you. But now I have things to deal with you. And Dynamic Punch has a very l big mischance. Oh my god. It's a, sp it's a speed tie. Wow. I actually might lose. No, I'm fine. Okay, I'm fine. Goal look is scary. That no guard... Well, uh, sorry. Just basically 
dynamic punch is a scary move. No one that's supposed to be uh, subject tested right now on Smoggin. Um, right. I need to heal. And I could do with potions that deal more. And do I have a revive? I have a revive. Cool. Bye. I do not mind using revives on you. I know that trainers wouldn't use revives. That just means I'm not using revives in battle. But outside of battle, I don't really mind using revives. Um, you. Can I challenge you? Right. Let's see what you've got here. You have a Gotham Reader. Well, Spidey, you've done this before. Night Slash? Ooh, that does really nice damage. Size Shock, wow. So much for Spidey doing damage. But Spidey will get the kill because he's able to live. <laughs> he's quicker than Gotham Reader, so he gets the kill. Okay, Spidey. You did the work. You deserve a rest now. I will give you a potion in a minute. An onyx coming in. Uh, bubble beam the onyx, please. Dragon breath. No, there's nothing to worry about that. You have no special attack. You have no physical attack. You have nothing to deal with me, onyx. You suck. And a snorlax. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Play. Kickstart, come in here, please. Why isn't Blaze Kick both fire and fighting type? Should be. Brick break. Kill. Nice, it does. That did the work. Okay. I am happy now. Um. There you go. You can have that potion and you'll be back up to full health. Right. Is a uh, oh here he is the gym leader. Ooh, if this wasn't a randomizer, I would be very scared of these two Pokemon right here. But this is a randomizer, so I'm not scared of any of these Pokemon. Let's save. Let's save the game. And let's pose for fun now. There you go, Sheninja and a Sheninja and this guy, an 11 year old. Control Sheninja and a Gengar being controlled by an 11 year old. So, you've come at last. I've been watching you stumble around my gym for quite some time now. Yeah, I'm sorry, I just can't find the light switch. I'm sorry about that. I can't find the light switch, so I'm stumbling around your gym. I hope that's okay. Excuse me, I'm just a kid. I happen to be the strongest gym leader around. Not only was I trained by my twin brother in the Elite Four, you don't hear him call, uh, anyone calling him just a kid, do you? Here we go, Graham. Graham, you better evade some golden Grahams because you will go down. Oh my god, I just made a girl. I just said I just made a golden Grahams joke. Oh my god. No Pokemon games, take note. Do not call any of your gym leaders Graham, because I'll end up making that joke again, and I don't want to make that joke again. <laughs> that's just such a that's so bad. Please brick break this thing. This thing is setting up on me. And I don't like it one bit. Brick break. I do not like you, Lifebird. You were like the worst cat Pokemon. Uh, is that an Ekans coming in? Because I want to switch if that's an Ekans coming in. I don't have anything to deal with Ekans coming in, but... Uh, let's bring in Meg. I want to try to return out of Meg. That neck it's an elekid. Ah. Oh. I still think this is the right idea. I want to bring a return. Discharge. Owie, owie, ow. Return? Oh, return does quite a bit of nice damage. It's a shame I can't stay in on that. But that's good some good damage, but then again. 
Discharge paralyzed and took me down to half HP because I'm just a I'm just a little punny. Ever a Beniri. If I was a little punny, I'd be so happy, but I'm not a not a little punny yet. Nice. And a Pidgey. Well I can't Wait, I can totally stay in. I can totally stay in. I can totally stay in on a Pidgey. It's a Pidgey. It's level 37, but it's a Pidgey. I have not, nothing to worry about with a Pidgey. I'm sorry. Wait, I actually might have things to worry about. He's feather danced me twice now. That might be that might be scary. Oh, you withdrew the Pidgey and put a Vaporeon out here. Was that so you could actually do some damage? I'm going to spike your shield now. Okay. Right. You, roar, you aqua ring. Is it, was this just to get... Really? You were just doing this to get HP back. And now you... Wow, you. You bought in the Pidgey to do some damage... You brought in the Pidgey to do damage to me. You bring, you keep on switching between this Pidgey and Vaporeon, thinking that you can do damage. Right. You know what? Zenny, you're not helpful in this situation. But one Pokemon that is helpful in this situation is named Beacon, my starter. Beacon, Thunder Punch. Also, Live. Ooh, nice. I can't heal. Stop healing. Stop healing your Pokemon. It's so goddamn annoying because I can't do that. I, well, I could do that. I just don't want to do that because it seems a little cheap. So I'm not going to. Stop it. Stop switching between the Pidgey and the Vaporeon. Oh, look, the Pidgey's now dead. Nice work, Beacon. Dust Noir. Well, GG. I can't really do too much to that. I guess Bitey could come in here and Bitey could... Uh, bite him up. I got the... I got the Paralyze off. At least that's something. Ah, uh, the that's a full heal. So much for the paralyze. Okay, Night Slash is doing the damage. Black uh, Night Slash is doing the damage here. Nice. Alright. You have a Vaporeon left. I'm going to you know what? I'm gonna stay in. I'm gonna stay in. Poison Fang. Can I get the poison? I can live one of those. I live for 2 HP! Yes, Brady! Alright, cool! But, but... It's ironic, isn't it? I only lost two battles since becoming a gym leader. One of them was to you, and the other one was to that other kid earlier today. Well... Something's going to beat. Someone's going to beat me. I'm glad it's just it's a kid. You're proving that we can hold up our own as in this adult-run world. I got the Necro Badge. The Necro Badge allows me to use Surf outside our bar. I also got TM96 Zombie Strike. Zombie Strike is a rather interesting move. It has a physical ghost. It's a physical ghost type. It's one of the only physical ghost type moves existing. If your Pokemon has a high attack stat, it will benefit from the move. Can you do me a favor? Go all the way and collect all the badges and challenge the Elite Four. I want you to beat my team brother, Tobias. I can't do it myself, but you. I, well, I'm hoping you can do it. Visit me again if you do, okay? Perhaps we can battle again. I wouldn't mind that. You are not a bad gym leader, you know. Graham is not a bad gym leader. 
Not a bad gym leader at all. I'm going to find my way out of this gym. I'm going to find my way out of this gym. Whether it kills me or not, I'm going to find my way out of this gym. There we go. I found my way out of this gym. And that was a good gym, too. It took me a while to get past it, but good gym puzzle. Uh, interesting uh, trainers and a good gym leader, too. Really interesting, just for an 11-year-old. I will definitely take a victory over the Necro Badge, though, and get my fifth gym badge here today. I'm very happy about that. Anyway, this is when I'm going to stop today's episode. So, in today's episode, we got the Necro Badge from Graham. And until next time, I'm Josh PH Games, and if you enjoyed, you can leave a like, comment, and subscribe. But I'll see you again, everyone. Good night.